The RF Budget Analyzer app guides you through a workflow for RF system design that's more effective than what is offered by traditional tools such as spreadsheets and circuit simulators. You can build an arbitrary chain representing a transmitter or a receiver by cascading elements such as amplifiers, modulators, S-parameter files and generic blocks. First you start by specifying the center frequency, average power and bandwidth of the incoming signal. The system parameters will be used for the analysis, based on FRIS formulas. You describe an RF transmitter or receiver by adding elements to the cascade. Elements can be represented with datasheet parameters such as gain, noise figure, IP3 and input and output impedances. The S parameters element allows you to import two port touchstone files and see the effects of frequency selectivity and impedance mismatches on the budget. If the S parameter data is passive, then the noise figure of the element is automatically computed and added to the budget. Modulators and demodulators can describe both superheterodyne and homodyne architectures depending on the ratio between the local oscillator and the input frequency. For superhet systems, you can describe multi-stage low and high side injection modulators and model, for example, different radar front ends or wireless communications transceivers. You can iterate on the budget analysis by adding different components with different specifications. Once satisfied with the architecture, the number of stages and the first pass results, you can export the cascade. You can automatically generate a MATLAB script to create a budget object. This allows you to programmatically analyze the cascade over different design parameters and corner cases. For example, you can extend the analysis over a wider range of frequencies. To go beyond simple analytical computations, the RF Budget Analyzer app generates an RF block set model suitable for multi-carrier circuit envelope simulation. The automatically generated model includes the correct settings for the input and output ports, solver configuration, and also the modulator image and channel selection filters. The simulation results of the model reproduce the analytical computations of the app. In the case of a direct conversion receiver, the local oscillator frequency is the same as the input frequency. In this case, a quadrature architecture is automatically generated. The RF Budget Analyzer app also generates a measurement test bench to validate the simulation results of your model. You can measure the same metrics analytically computed by the app, gain, noise figure, IP3. This gives you confidence that when the model is integrated in the system simulation, it behaves as expected. In addition, you can also measure IP2, DC offset and image rejection, which can't be computed using FRIS formulas. This allows you to further elaborate the device under test model to include additional impairments. The generated test bench represents a virtual measurement setup that validates the device under test in realistic conditions. For example, direct conversion receivers are tested at low IF, just like in the real lab. Within Simulink, by leveraging fast circuit envelope simulation, you can integrate the RF front end together with digital signal processing algorithms and control logic. Starting from the automatically generated model, you can elaborate the architecture, for example, to include Simulink controlled tunable RF components to model automatic gain control, beamforming, or adaptive matching networks. You can elaborate your design to cover a wide set of scenarios and device configurations. For example, you can now include complex control logic and see the effects of in-band and out-of-band interfering signals. This model, for example, reproduces the behavior of a real-life transceiver. Thanks to the RF Budget Analyzer app, RF system design, modeling, and simulation is made easier. Don't hesitate to use the RF Toolbox and RF Block Set in your latest RF design challenge.